The kiddos deserve one more episode of Broken Sword, so the kiddos shall get it. <laughs> shall get another episode. Anyway, today today is March 28th. I, I swear I record I recorded an episode this morning, um, but we're we're back at it. Back at back at bat, you know, like baseball. We're back at home plate, or home base, whatever. I don't know. Uh, excuse me, There's father. There's a priest here. He's gonna Pardon? help us out. Do you mind if I ask you a few questions? Not at all, monsieur. Oh no. It will be my pleasure to help you. Have you ab abused any underage boys? How long have you worked here? Hardly work, monsieur. This is a calling. I have been helping Father Flambert for nearly six months now. Okay. I guess you don't know much about the history of this church, then. That's only six Just months. That's not that long. You've got quite a shine on that candlestick. Ah, oui. Anything less than best would be an insult for the Almighty. I guess so. I never thought of it like that. Why are we talking about the candlestick? What do you know about the Knights Templar? You have come to the right place, if that is your interest. Well, Many of them I were should executed hope so. in the square outside. It was a disgrace to France. Well, the Pope was right behind it, though. Clement V was a man of mammon, not of God. That's kind of forthright for a priest, isn't it? You think so? It is hard to be sure what happened. It is so long ago. I noticed that the stained glass window on the left looks more modern than the middle one. I can't, I don't now have any comment nice. about Clement V. The so. original window was destroyed in the last war. It was as old as the church. Early I don't even have century. any comment about the oh, man. current Pope, That's Pope awful. Francis. We, oui, a terrible loss. Still, the church and the other windows survive. I know Pope John Paul and George and Ringo. Catch you later. Au revoir, monsieur. Oh, uh, I'm not funny. I like your red cap, though. Where can I get a red cap like that? Well, the knight in the manuscript was holding a lens, so let me see if this knight is holding a lens also. Per disciplinum meum, lux videbis. The lens fitted in something the or other. Ah, I forgot it. <laughs> like per disciplinum. Mayum Lux, Lux Videbus. Videbus. Oh! Hey! Hey! Okay, so this is a fun puzzle. So we got lay. Okay. Basically, we got layer number one, layer number two. That looks like a helmet, so I'm gonna leave that right there. Layer number. Come on. No, I, I like layer one where it is. You stay right there. Layer two. Um, what are we looking at? No, I don't want to move layer one. God. I want his hand to be where his hand should be. <laughs> Obviously. I want his helmet to be right there. And again, lining up the fist with the rest of the hands. The distortions came sharply in the book. It was a knight templar burning at the stake. And below him, a date in Roman numerals. MCCCX14. A knight one, templar four, burning at the stake. 13 and 14. Date. Let me see. MCCCXIV. That's. 1314. Thank you, George. Thank you, George. Okay. <laughs> that's that's cool. That's definitely some like Da Vinci conspiracy, Da Vinci code level fellows. biblical references engraved into stuff, the tomb the, edge to guide his way to the next The world. stained glass I image guess. hiding another image basically if you turn turn the picture a certain a way. Knight. Um so what's the next puzzle that we have to do. Always a little bit different commentating Hello again, live father. as opposed oh, to... Jean, Is the right hand window original? Oui, monsieur. Didn't we just talk about this? Do you speak Latin? You ask this of a... Okay. Can you well, tell we already me know what... what it means. Let me see. That would be uh, by my teachings. You Sounds like the same voice actor as Benoit. 
Yeah. They said, That's just do I another too. shy, nervous voice. Catch you later. Au revoir, monsieur. <laughs> really, George, saying catch you later to a priest? Uh... There's some, there's, isn't there something with the tombs? A stone knight lay in full stone armor, blank eyes looking at the ceiling. That's great. Carrying all that armor around must have that, been hard yeah, that, work. Wow, thank you, thank you for that comment, George. Da, 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 da. Okay, are we done here? Do we want to talk to Nico again? Do we want to think about all the firm buttocks that have sat on the church pews over the years? <laughs> Uh, this game is so dumb sometimes. It's great, but, you know, you know what I mean. Pass the cafe. Spend a nice Parisian morning sipping your cafe. 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 Okay, I'm done. Where's Nico's apartment? Will it skip automatically? Yeah. I solved another puzzle. <laughs> I love his well, childish joy I about that. Well, what it's was like... It? What's the answer? When you're playing 13, a video game 14. and you're really what proud of yourself mean? and it was you want to tell Jacques your girlfriend, it's like, hey, no, I solved another puzzle on Ocarina of Time. Oh my god. Window. Give me a hug. When I looked through the lens, the picture <laughs> Not changed. That I would know. It became a man surrounded by flames. It seems to me the answers to the Temple of It Pazuzza seems to me you've been watching too case. much Indiana Jones Sometimes and you're I wonder making if up stuff. An elaborate joke. Right, it nice seems to be too kind of people to play literal jokes, were they? in the way it's fulfilling itself. Let's take another... So yeah, two men Look. riding the same horse, the There's tripod... There's a, a sword and a bull between them. We've already done the gem thing we've already been to bull's head we've already a looked knight, through the knights through my not a crystal ball but a lens um there's a guy have we done anything with was that a clue to lockmarn or was that a clue to um there's a woman Sturtis. looking at her ref but the ref that, that was just like the statue that we saw in the cave at Bull's Head. Uh, what do we do next? Get on a plane. No, we can't get on a plane. Yeah, last time, I, I really do hope this is the Ukraine because that peninsula looks like the Crimean Peninsula. But if, you know, I'll correct myself in the comments, I'm sure. Um, we can go to the museum again. I'm not sure why we would, but Andre might be here. Andre might have new dialogue for us. I don't know. Hi, Andre. Let's just mess around uh, until where you we been? figure Nicole something out. Nico said you were away. Yeah, we I were in a couple from Syria. countries. Syria? On the trail of the Templars? Yes, sir. It's a long story, but I found the bull's head. It was referred to on the manuscript, remember? Yes. Uh, what is it? A secret cave built into a high cliff face. In the cave, I discovered a map bearing a phrase in Latin. In Occidenta Sita Est in Ora Mundi. The island of Brita. Lies at the edge of the world to the west. Strange. That map seems to contain a series of pointers. The earth like is flat. Said, it's a treasure map. Thanks for your help, Andre. You're welcome. So, what, we're going to Britain next? Are we? We do go to Scotland at some point. Let's talk to Nico again. <laughs> I don't know. If, if, I, if this was post, I would know what Hello, I was George. doing and I would actually look at a walkthrough and be prepared. I'd better be get back prepared. To uh... You're back! Well, I wasn't... No! On duty? No! I am not just drinking, not just drinking wine. wine! I am, am undercover. Under I must be missing something. You're in uniform. That's a good point. Precisely, monsieur. My... Cover is that of an indolent, wine-guzzling police officer. You've got me convinced. Merci. But in reality, 
He says while hiccuping. I'm pretty sure that was a hiccup. <laughs> what are you, Sheldon Cooper? Who Psang? or what were you planning to pazang on? You must have heard, Monsieur, of the terror that is gripping Paris. You mean the killings? Oh, at last, someone's taken action. <laughs> People die every day. No, no, I am on the trail of Sewer Jacques. I, uh... Who? <laughs> Sewer Jacques. <laughs> I don't remember this. He pops up here. He pops up there. Is it me? <laughs> I better make sure I take a shower. Bravo, that's very Making good. poetry on us. I was up half the night writing that. Oh my god. Who is this? Ah, but he is cunning. To despoil the sewers of our fair city, he has committed many deceptions. He's he definitely has drunk. He to be a police officer and deluded a poor war veteran. Oh no, it is uh -oh. us. He has pretended to be a jongleur. Wow, is that the time? And an American tourist. What nationality are you, monsieur? I'm Canadian. Canadian. Well, uh, gotta go now. See ya. Well, it's not everyone who can say they started an urban myth. Uh, hold on. I I gotta go use the bathroom. Just if Batman shows up, it's definitely not me. All I'm saying is you'll never see us in the same room at the same time. No, it's a conspiracy. J JFK. No. Oh my God. Years the ago, the there was this. Was some around the base. Years ago, there was this um, homeless well, lady on the. But I wanted other than. To... On the end of. Okay, we already S done this. Okay, is it time for me to look at a walkthrough? Somehow. It might be. In com I'm sorry. I'm gonna look at a walkthrough. Brb. Well, I must complain for a second about the walkthrough spelling chalice as C-H-A-L-L-I-S. Not sure what's wrong with them. Um, I will take it to the manager. <laughs> Hello again, Father. Bonjour, Monsieur. How Did we speak to... I noticed no? that the stained glass... You have a keen eye, It was as old as the church. Early 14th century. Oh, man. That's Early awful. 14th century? 1314? Still... The church and the other windows survived. Do we have to show him the chalice? What do you make of this chalice? It uh, certainly looks very old. About as old as this. Oh, is that why I they think. talk about how he's so Seems good at polishing, polishing the candlestick? Yeah. What does it say? Because they I want you to polish. Tarnished. With your permission, uh, I could try polishing it. Uh, I promise I will be very careful. Go ahead. That'd be very good of you. This uh, shouldn't take very long. Feel free to look around. Okay. Okay, thanks. Yay. Making progress. To think. So, in I have my OB OBS window zoomed Summer. in a little bit in hopes that it'll make the game more clear. I a night, I was embarrassed in the because I was watching a Biblical video essay on Space Funeral today, to and his way to the, next the text world, actually I looked guess. like it was supposed to. And then I realized I had I had a font glitch when I downloaded Space Funeral, and I should have looked into that and tried to fix it. But no, I limped my way through that game four. with the font looking as crappy as it did. Um. <laughs> I think we've just about done everything. Oh, you can see this sparkle. They animated a little sparkle onto the chalice that he's holding. Thank you, hey, sir. Hey, thanks. It is my pleasure, monsieur. What? What was the writing on the chalice? It was not writing. Uh, my mistake. It was a coat of arms. Oh, the remarkable okay. thing is that it seems very familiar. The Tevascan chalice. Oui. I think I have seen it on that wall tomb in the far corner. That winged horse is quite distinctive. 
The Vasconcellos. Is the we miss you. Oh my god, he keeps asking about the same exact thing. Catch you later. Oh. So, now we can finally look at the tombs. It's I think this game is pretty distinct for having things a stone being unlocked by on. dialogue, but I I guess not. Um, a stone knife in in the in the way of in the way of adventure games that I've played. This game sticks out to now me because you can't. Was no name on it, but the coat of arms was. You can't just do a puzzle if you know the solution the already. Nevasco you have Jello's to like family. be like, oh, what's this? Oh, what's this? Oh, really? Of Don Carlos, my eye was drawn hey. to biblical reference. You have to show to one item to one person. Hey, maybe these biblical references mean something. Okay, finally. A jumble of letters are carved onto the side of the knight's tomb. You must look for and highlight a number of biblical verse references comprising the name of a book, followed by the chapter and verse in Latin numerals. For example, Luke chapter 8 verse 2 would be displayed as Luke 8 2. All right. With a plus instead of the colon. Like, you know, I grew up going to church, so I do know. Uh, an Anuit coeptus... Horribilis ad majorum mundi. Alright, we have Corinthians 1, 4, Corinthians. 5. 14, 5. Yeah, it must have meant something. If I examine the tomb more closely, there might be I like be the loud symbol that plays. Uh, Psalms 32, 7. Psalms 32, 7. The numbers referred to a chapter and a verse in the Bible. Psalms 22, 21. Psalms 22, 21. Uh, and the last one is vertical. That's, I remember being stuck on this last time and then I was like, oh, the last one is vertical. There were no more references to find, but a series of Roman numerals ran around the plaque. I made a note in case they meant something. Okay. Psalms 32, 7, John 4, 11, Corinthians 1, 4, 5, and... No, you said 14, 5. You said 14, 5. Psalms 22, 21. I may not be perfect, but I've got a memory like a steel trap. I wish my memory the was that good. The chalice had led me to these inscriptions. Good. My memory is good, but... But it looked like a happy coincidence. All those numbers. After all, would the take me a while before I felt confident with them. Nope. I was still convinced that the chalice had some significance all of its own. Okay. Now, uh, we will need those scriptures in a second. But I've got the walkthrough open, so I don't really give give a cow's tail anymore. <laughs> that sounds like a cardiac song, a cow's tail. Hello again, Is father. It? I don't know. Bonjour. Oh the my God. Burning man? Oh yeah, yeah. What, okay, you? okay, okay. That there was a hidden image, no. But the church has a reputation for being haunted. Many times, people have claimed to have seen a burning man in the window. But when others they look, there is nothing. Perhaps the light has to be just so for the figure to appear. Yeah, or maybe you need a special lens. Boy, merci. Catch you later. Au revoir. Um, maybe we can go talk to Nicole about the scripture references that we found. That's all I got. That's all I got to go on. They will come. They will come back. You know. All right. How am I doing on time? Uh, Twenty minutes. Hello, George. Hello, George. Let's take a. There's a. Uh, there's but yeah. the refl. A, a night through my. There's between Yepperoni. Okay, Look we, at the chalice we polished now, the chalice. What happened? It's Shani. The priest at Montfaucon buffed it up for me. That's incredible. Yeah, looks as good as new. No, you found a uh, use stop. for the priest. <laughs> That's incredible. 
I'd better get back to the quest. Back to questing. Happy questing. Um, one more time, let's look at the church. And then I'll look at my walkthrough. Um. So that's the tomb that we looked at already. And then we got this tomb right here and then that tomb right there. Yep. Just doing a thorough a carrying all that off. thorough sweep of a the church. I all right. One second. Okay, so now we talk to Andre again. You wouldn't think of Andre as the most biblical guy, but, you know, he is a scholar. I guess I shouldn't say that. Because he called Nico sexy, I mean... Oh, come on. I'm sorry. I'm being a silly boy. Music rune! Let's go. Andre. Hi, Andre. Hello. While I was in Syria, I discovered a strange oh, the, we're not even, statue. Okay. It was like a head with three bearded faces. Horrible. That doesn't even have anything to do with what we just did. The idol described by the Templars. The poor knights of Christ had an idol that looked like that? Allegedly, yes. Uh, the description of the idol came from the evidence yeah, would... extracted by the Inquisition. What? Mind you, not one statue or idol was ever found on Templar property. Until now, that is. Just last month, a statue of Baphomet was unearthed right here in Paris. Oh shoot, is that maybe Where? what the At professor the was talking about? Hermetique de Naval. The statue is beneath the foundation. Oh shoot. It was discovered oh, by okay. some workman while Renner We want to go there here. then. Can you tell me any more about the statue of Baphomet? It's a fearful image, even now. A bearded head. The base so of bad the statue about is carved with Templar I'm growing symbols. a beard right now. One of the workmen noticed a curious stain Oh, at no, face. don't talk about curious he stains. It looked like blood. Blood? It's paint. Right. Thanks for your help, Andre. You're welcome. Ba do 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 Ba do 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 there's no painting here. There's a painting here, Shaggy. Well, there wasn't before. It's paint. Let's follow it. And then the statue's eyes follow them, or whatever. The painting's eyes follow them. All right, goodbye. Happy questing. Take care. Enjoy your day. And I'll see you in the next episode for more Broken Sword.